Hey, 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 this is the real Dr. G. Big up and respect from Negril, Jamaica, man. I'm here at home. I'm just visiting a property where I have a room here. I'm an investor in hotel rooms, you know, I do all kinds of things. I'm a medical doctor by degree, <laughs> but I've always been an entrepreneur. I grew up at this hotel here in the grill in, in the, um, and um, I ended up leaving the grill to go to school, to go away to go to school and became a medical doctor so that I could come back to the grill and improve the healthcare system and give back to my community. So over the years I've done a lot of different things, gone through a lot in life and basically been revamping, reinvesting, liquidating things that I, I couldn't manage to, to own anymore. So I've gone through a lot and I acquired a, um, a property here. My room is, my hotel room is at the end right here on this block, but it's occupied right now, so I can't show it to you. But what I wanted to do is give you guys an example of how the room looks at the beach club. So you can share my video for me and show people how the property looks, okay? Just wanna show you how in here stays, that we're on the patio area right here now. And some beds, some rooms come with one bed. This one has two double beds. So four people can stay in this one room. And sometimes these rooms go for like $50 a night. But when it's in the season, it's up to $80 a night. It just depends on the season and how many people. So we could even put a microwave there if you need one, you know, but this is like. Everywhere for animals, and I think this is the way up here. White, white one. We're the just painting one? this room right now, so I'm getting a little tour of just this room that was renovated the other day. So this is a room with a shower right here. It's a stand-up shower, very nice and clean, clean facility. You know, there's a window right there to air out the room if you need to open the window, it's no problem. That's me, Karen G. Hello. So basically, I came in my swimsuit so I could go down to the beach and swim, you know, but it just rained not too long ago. But I want to still show you how the property looks. So basically, this is this. So I'm going to show you. This room is one that is at the front of the hotel. It's very close to the parking lot. That's my boo right there coming with some food from the parking lot. So we can chill in this room while they, while they do some painting. That's Dwight. Big up Dwight with his beautiful, handsome smile. He's one of our housekeepers slash painter slash jack of all trades. So he's the one painting the room right now while he's all messy right now. So excuse his look. Not true, Dwight. <laughs> There's some bathroom facilities nearby. So people who are visiting or popping in and out can still use the bathroom if you don't have a room. Hello, good day. Good evening. Fine, thank you. This is the Christmas tree. <laughs> Anyway, so this is the lobby area right here at the Negro Beach Club. Um, when you come in, you know, the security is going to be just checking up on you, just questioning to see what you're doing here if you come into the bar and restaurant or if you're staying here or just popping in for spa services. There's a gym across the street there. We're right on the main road at the be um, in the grill where you can just grab a taxi across the street. The taxis, one of them just drove off earlier. He was parked underneath the tree. So sometimes you see like one or two cabs under the tree. But right now it's a little slow. It's coronavirus pandemic time when I'm doing this video right here. Usually you just drive around, go to the parking lot area and it's a nice big parking lot. So here is where you will check in. We go up to Kevin, who is one of the bosses here on the property. I left my mask in, my, in the room, you know, on the patio, but this is where my mask... Oh, you're eating here? I thought you are going to eat by the room, by the patio. You can't eat by the patio, you know, it's no problem. <laughs> so they're going to fresh up this, the room anyway when we leave. So these are the bathroom areas here. This is the area here where you can... So basically, I'm showing you the, the room that's right there, this hallway. You can take this area here to the right, or you can take the left side of the hotel. So what happened, they have blocks. There are different blocks with different rooms that go from the A block. They have A, B, C. The D block is in the corner there where the duty free shop is. Then you have the E block right there where you see my purse right there on the patio. You see my black handbag there. That's where we were. And they used to have a little plum tree right here, but it, oh, they, they uprooted the plum tree. That's what that used to be. <laughs> It used to bear a lot, but it looked like it got old. I don't know what these are, but some kind of fruit. Something hanging down right here. 
and they even have rooms in the back area right there that faces the road so the e-block has rooms on the front end that face the garden hey somebody waving hi boo <laughs> hi smiley <laughs> he has such a nice smile that's why i love him so much too so we come on holiday we come and we stay in these rooms the reggae suite is right here <laughs> So anyway, in here in Jamaica, in the, in this facility, we have different owners. So one of the owners named their rooms. One is Reggae Suite. This is Calabash. You know, so what happened is different people advertise on social media. They go online and advertise the room. So we do have different owners. And right now, they blocked off the pool because of Corona. And they closed off the jacuzzi. They drained the jacuzzi because of the COVID-19. So, so a lot of it. So some... So at one time they were allowing people to use the pool but because of the cases going up in this area they closed the pool area but what happened if you don't put the chairs around the area then people still jump in or they, they go at night time and sneak in so they seriously just put some barriers around there with the chairs you know so if you want to be on the beach itself this is the j block on this side and the opposite side is the a block that's the spa there big up to jasmine spa that's security over there chilling anyway so we have a nice bar and restaurant area here where you can come and chill at the bar you know it's well covered up so even when it's raining and thing, you can come and have a meal you can let you can have a have food here by the bar or you can eat over there by the restaurant side there you we host a lot of events here you know like weddings reunions um, medical mission type of work all types of things occur here at the beach club so this is the beach area guys and that's the artist and artist who is on the beach who is selling carvings and we also have like a dive shop over there one love scuba center so it's beautiful out the, the beach is huge that's one thing about the beach club is that the beach is huge that's the island over there a lot of people take the boat hire the boat and go to the island over here and have picnics where they serve you lobster and stuff and or jerk chicken just depends who you go with so a lot of people have been you know it's sunday today when i'm doing this video so it's a bit quiet and the rains came earlier so it looked like a lot of people not hanging out on the beach furthermore while i'm doing this video it's a different time of the year where it's around christmas time but the, the government has a curfew in effect where people has to go be in by seven o'clock and they did close the beach. They didn't want anybody to be on the beach in Negril or Bluefields, which is another beach up this, like about 40 minutes away. So it's just a different change in the rules, in the law that's happened recently. Why is it the beach so empty? But, but there are times when the beach full and you see all kind of people socializing right here under the trees, under the almond trees and near the lifeguard chair and so forth or the chilling by the security by the shop there you know so people socialize and thing or they go next door and hang out with the guys on the beach and thing and patronize the bars and restaurants along the way so you can walk here from the beach club on the beach and head to bars and restaurants right up the street right there that have great food if you don't want to use the restaurants here all right so big up and respect to everybody watching share the video for me please Share the video for me i'm glad i made it i had some drama at the airport with my flight yesterday but yeah and i'm having some wicked headaches from lifting the bag because i have a rod in the middle of my back and it's i noticed that when i lift too much it hurts in the front right here so basically <clears throat> i'm taking it easy and i'm not too fussy about going into the water right now still because i'm just having a lot of pain right now but staying at the beach club when i stay here i don't have to worry about going back and forth from home to, to the beach if I want to just relax at the beach but I'm somebody who get hot easily and I don't want to I don't just lie on the beach and tan all day that's what happened I have my health problems that I go through so what I do I come and I get a chair and I chill right there by the lifeguard chair or you know I sit down there if you smoke you can smoke it your weed chill drink with your rum punch your beer you know whatever it is that you like because that's they legalize a lot of those things lately you know you can come for the ganja fest you can come for dream weekend there are a lot of events that happening that are going to be coming back in the following year you know hopefully so we just have to take it by ear and see how it's going with the pandemic at this time of the year 
and next year as we're going in from 2020 to 2021 you know uh, today is already what december 20th is it yeah it's already like you know it, christmas is coming in, in soon this week hey good day you all right good day so yeah so basically that's it there's the beach for guys <laughs> somebody having a good time up on their patio area <laughs> so sometimes people have weddings here in the garden area but we hardly really use the garden area you know, because the beach is so spacious and the restaurant and bars are spacious the pool area is spacious as well I'll show you guys where the duty free shop is around this ends right here so yeah so that's the beach club guys hola tourists for the day how long are you staying for a week that's it are you having fun so far I saw you relaxing taking a tan over there in the chair yeah Okay, great. Well, enjoy your food. What are you having? Chicken with rice and peas? No tripe and bean today? Oh, yeah, that too? All righty. Well, enjoy. <laughs> That's the room that I was showing you guys earlier. I'm going right back to that room right now. Go join him and eat some food. So this is the mini mart area right here they have like little ice cream snacks and things here you can get your papers your lighter jewelry rum water you know certain things you can get here they might be more pricey than downtown but when it comes to like the liquor they generally have good prices on the liquor i would say it just depends what you want you know so you just walk this way we have stairs that go up to the next block to the next floor but if this is like three floors of rooms, this building, the E-block. So basically, that's it, guys. That's a tour of the beach club condos. So, like I say, if you guys want a room, you can book with me directly. You can link my mom, Jean Gainier. She's also on Instagram. She's on Facebook. You can follow us on Facebook, Instagram. Let me go. I, I always trying to pin these comments on Instagram. And every time I try, it, it never works out for me. I don't know why, if I'm not doing it properly. Beach Club Condos Jamaica and pin it. Yeah, sorry about that. I'm using my US phone, so the signal kind of trying to go through the towers to get to you guys. I'm not using my Jamaican phone, which is what I should have done, to be honest. It actually flow way better with flow. I mean Digicel. <laughs> I got Digicel and it working good. Negril Beach Club Condos in Negril, Jamaica. Boom, 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 boom. post okay all right so you can link me anytime guys like i say you know my phone number is right there on my bio um you can link me on facebook instagram and message me through any type of media all right and if i don't get back to you just um just be patient and just message me again if you don't hear from me all right if you seriously want to inquire about the rooms at the beach club all right guys but it's hot, hot, hot. The weather is beautiful. Big up to everybody worldwide. I know a lot of people are experiencing the winter, which is when we get a lot of tourists coming down and think to stay with us at the beach club. All right, guys. So like I said, we've been in business for like over 42 years at the condos. And hopefully you can come and patronize us one of these days. Or help me to share the flyers. All right, guys. And just um, get the word out and think about the rooms for me. All right. So you can help out me and my family and still because it's been slow with the room rentals, you know. A lot of people scared to fly, a lot of people scared to travel because of the coronavirus pandemic. So we have to lay off a lot of people who can't, who can't work or we have to schedule the staff a certain way. So 
after they don't lose their job because it's been so slow. Seriously, worldwide is what's going on. So I'm trying to help out and thing by doing as much advertising like I can, but I'm in pain right now, my back killing me. <laughs> so I'm gonna relax on the patio and relax and chill. And um, I might head into the water a little bit because I still have some more time before the curfew to go into the water and soak a little bit. I might just soak in the salt water before I go home. So that's what's nice about staying at the hotel. You have the, the beach access right there. Cool. And the pool is there whenever the pool is open. But for now, it's closed. All right, guys. So big up my respect. Respect to everybody out there who's been watching. Love to you guys.